how to upload music to Instagram. We will show you exactly from start to finish how to get your professionally made song or some other artist's song on Instagram from start to finish. So let's get going. Unfortunately, we can't just go to Instagram and upload our song to, to Instagram. There are two ways to do it though. For example, if, if we want to go and add a story and we made this story, for example, I'm just filming my screen here. So let's say I made a very quick video. Now, if I want my music to show up in this section under music, this is the first way, and I'm going to show you how to get your song up here in the official Instagram songs. The other way is actually you just, while you're making this video, you are playing your song in the background, or you've made a video with a high quality music file inside of it. You can just post that video. That will give the people or your audience, anyone on Instagram, the opportunity to listen to your song, but also use your song in their videos. So if we just close this down and go over to the home page here and go to Reels, just this video, we can see at the bottom here, original audio. If I click this, I can actually use this audio right here if I just say use audio. Now I can make a video with this audio. So that can be your song as well. You don't have to have your music in the official Instagram music to be available for other people to use it. So that's very important to know. If you want your sound to be used by other people, you don't necessarily have to have it inside, I'll show you again, inside this area. Those are two separate things. Okay, so the first way to get your song uploaded to Instagram in the official sounds area would be to use a music distributor. Now, unfortunately, we just can't go to Instagram and upload it there. There's no upload button. They don't deal directly with artists and musicians who want their music on Instagram. You have to deal with another person. And this person is actually a company. They are a middleman, also known as a music distributor. So I'm gonna go over one music distributor and I'll also name a, a couple others you can use because there are a lot and they will, they will all charge you differently. Yes, because you do need to pay to get your music on Instagram. Unfortunately, it's not free. You do need to pay, it's reasonably priced and every distributor will price differently. So for example, if you pay for music distribution and I'm gonna go over an example right now with using DistroKid, this is a music distributor. You pay DistroKid at minimum $20 a month to get your music on uploaded to Instagram. At $20 a month, you have your music on Instagram and by the way, you can have it on Spotify and Apple Music and TikTok, all the other streaming services and you keep 100% of your royalties they say here after any taxes or whatnot. I'm not sure exactly what that means, but they declare it right there. There are some other music distributors that you can use that they give you free distribution. So you can get your music on Spotify, on Apple Music, on TikTok for free. They won't charge you anything. However, they will take a percentage of your royalties. So like what I was saying, when someone streams your song, well, let's say you make a hundred bucks, the distributor might say, well, we want to keep 10 of that. So that would be 10%, or we might want to keep 15 of that. So that might be 15%. It will depend on the music distributor. It's totally a personal choice of what you want to go with and how you want to pay for your music distributor. But that's something you will need to look into and decide before you get your music uploaded to Instagram. Let's use DistroKid because it's very simple and it's easier for us to kind of get our heads wrapped around it in this video and to get our music uploaded to Instagram. So Sign up for a DistroKid account if you want to use DistroKid. There is a 7% discount link in the description. I'll also leave one to TuneCore for 20%. You can use these discount links if you want to, uh, but you totally don't have to as well. So if that's step one, find a music distributor. Step two is getting all your information uploaded to the music distributor. You can see here, Instagram and Facebook. So we're gonna wanna make sure that's clicked because that's gonna get our music uploaded to Instagram. If you want other streaming services, like I was saying, you can go and click those as well. Go through the information. It's gonna be all the same for the music distributors and it's very simple. One I wanna point out is the release date where you actually can declare, when do you want your song uploaded to Instagram? Do you want it uploaded to Instagram on October 2nd or do you want it to be November 6th? You can decide when you want that song uploaded to Instagram. Of course, you will need your album cover and more importantly, the song name for them to go to Instagram and upload it for you. So that's step two, you've uploaded your song to the music distributor now. Step three is sit back, wait. When that date comes, go to Instagram, search for your song name or the artist name that you've uploaded there and you'll see it in Instagram. So that's how to upload your music to Instagram in the official sounds category in Instagram stories or in Instagram reels when you search for music. 
The second way is um, cheap and fast and easy, but it's not going to get you in the official songs. Essentially, you have a video that has sound, that sound, whether it's actually an actual song you made, someone else's song, or your voice. It's just sound. When you upload and publish this video to Instagram, that song or sound is now available for anyone on the platform to use. So if they really like the song you made in that video, they can use that song and put their own graphics to it, their own video. And then you will be tagged as the original song, the original audio, if you were the actual first person to make that song. An important thing to know here is if you go that route of getting your song or sound on Instagram, it will only be available in the Instagram platform. It won't be available on Spotify or TikTok or Apple Music. So that's how to upload your music to Instagram by doing it the official way and getting it in the official songs category, but also uploading any video or any song or audio you have and having giving you the opportunity to have other people use that song or sound. Please feel free to subscribe to this channel for more indie music marketing tips and we'll see you in the next video.